right. Twenty four Schaefer with the throw. Good block by Connor. Good block. Yeah. Reset throw by Daniel. Someone's got a block. Oh, good kill by, oh, good kill by Chubb. But unfortunately, Gross goes now. Unfortunately, in that exchange. All right, they will get it. Yeah, you go ahead and get the ball. Go ahead and get it. Evan Essenberg is most likely not going to be playing anymore at this point. Actually, this game. Daniel with a reset throw. Ah, oh, that's an easy catch. Easy catch. Easy catch. Not really much you could do in that. Oof. Good block. He's still safe, but. Definitely took one right off the eye. All right, reset throw by Connor. All right. Good throw by number 17, Telly. Number 30 from Cone. Getting the ball back. Maryland has full ball, so they have to throw and They have a 15 second shot clock. Reset will work. All right. And that's kind of in harm's way. But now Maryland got three balls left. Well, actually, no, they still got four. They still got four. And open palm. Wait, did he get out? Hit a ball. And another missed catch for Connor, unfortunately. Connor goes out of that exchange. Number 24 with the kill. Pretty sure the Schaefer. Let's see what Dixon going to do. 5.50 left in the first half. Eh, decent reset throw. Good turn. And that's an easy catch for my man, number 17, Tally. Ruben goes down, makes that a two for one special. And number two from Maryland, Chris goes down in that exchange. Maryland has three balls, so they have to throw at least one. Let's see what Dixon's gonna do. Number one for Maryland. He's pushing. Nope, never mind. Well, and down goes another Maryland player. This time, number three, Vincent, goes down. <sighs> As a result, Maryland have exactly six players left. If they lose another player, they'll be on the 10 count. Good pump fade by Bryce, protecting her teammate. Much needed. All right, and she sacrificed her ball to her teammates because she's going for a catch. All right, so somebody have to throw. 24 with the throw, all right, that's fair. They'll go set up. All right, single throw for number 24, Schaefer. Look like they're going out to number 24, Michael Chu. And unfortunately, he did not win that exchange. And just like that, Maryland would be on the, well, yeah, Maryland was on the 10 count. So, we got four players left. Apparently, they lost another player that exchange. Instead of making it six, making it four players. As also number 24, Michael Chu goes down. That was close. All right. Let's see what they're going to do here. They're thinking about it. And he could not get it. 25 of Maryland. Nick goes down that exchange. Could have been a catch. 
by the foot. 77 with the kill. Brown, she's still safe. Bryce is still safe. Let's see what a, oh, good catch by Dixon. Take it out, number 34, Cole from JMU. Bring it back, Daniel. Man, my man looking kind of swole. Anywho, um, Daniel's now back in the game. Let's see what my man can do. Marsh with the throw, no dice. The reset throw by Daniel. Let's zoom out a little bit. Brown, he's safe. Dixon is safe. All right, so, all right, so that's the strategy that Maryland wants to play. They want to have the majority of the balls. Daniel's got to push up. Actually, it's going to be Dixon. He's going to push up. And that's not going to count. That will. That was close. Oh, that's another catch for my man number one, Dixon. Brings back another of his teammates. This time it's Connor. We're getting some action now. If they're going for single throw, Dixon is in a prime position. Another, another stop ball. Not bad. Not bad from Connor. They have to have an outline. They can't just bring in random people. Like, they have to have an outline. They can't have guys that are out stopping the balls. They can't. They have to. We have to know what the outline is. I got you. I got you. Because, like, they can technically bring in whoever they wanted. I got you. I understand. Oh. Okay. They technically are supposed to have their jerseys inside out. Like, like I understand that's one. I'll cover that next one. Go ahead. I have to get it. All right. Reset throw. That will work for Daniel. Fair. Oh, good catch by number eight. Daniel is saying, nah, that was ground fam. Relax. 17, don't like that. They're going to make sure you're going to put two on him. Yeah, he's a little upset. 110 left. That'll work. All right, so they definitely know they can't throw a bread basket catches to number one, Dixon. So they might put two on him. Tough situation for Daniel and crew. Bryce is in the middle. That was ground. That's a great question, Drew. I don't know why you're not getting this point, but that's none of my business. Good catch, though, by Marsh. Now. The ball was thrown. So the ball is still in action. Meaning, okay. Anywho, oh, I got my man Andrew watching this. Andrew is a savage, y'all. Soft ref. Roughly 37, well, 39 point, 36 point nine seconds left. We got 14. P is he a walking rule book though, Andrew? I don't know. You tell me. Hey, you can thank your uh, you can thank your captain though, Evan Essenberg, for getting y'all those forfeit wins against Towson. Yeah, because he pulled that up out of the rule book. It's like, okay, I see you now. Like I said, today's pretty chill. All right, cool. Yes, sir. Got 17 people watching. Thank you for tuning in. Much appreciated. 
I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what you're doing. Anywho. All right, hold up, hold up, hold up. Let me stop the clock. The catch is good, though. The, the catch is good, though. Good catch by Daniel. It's like I got other things I got to do in my life. I don't feel like talking to you. Goes out of that change. And she got hit. And she just jammed her finger. You hate to see it. Can can Dixon survive? He actually will survive. Oh, wait a minute. No, no, no. What? No, 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 no. You know, yeah, no. Time out's call. Time out's call. Let me see if I can actually put three seconds on. Hold up, let me see something real quick. Okay, in all seriousness, I don't know how to set the time. But you guys do have time left. Like, oh. like, no joke, I don't. It's been a while since I've been here. But you do have time left on the clock. Okay. Yeah. Trying to figure out the clock situation. Jamie, you do have time left in the clock, at least three seconds. Most likely, it's probably going to be five or seven. Let's go. I think the timeout call like between like three to seven seconds. So, it's what. Three seconds, one person on the clock is for us. Right? Because it was called over at five. But yeah. then the clock didn't stop at five. It's called timeout from here. Okay. Okay. Thank you. So much. All right, so. No, I, I, nah, nah, Andrew, I understand. It's not that serious. Yeah, Andrew, I understand. No, it was ball sold. What? This one, okay. Anywho, seven seconds left. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Oh, you just, yeah. You just flick it to the right when you're ready. Anywho, seven seconds left for this half. Ball's over, unfortunately, go against Dixon. I'm not really sure why we're having a spirited conversation right now. We all know what the real score is going to be. James, you will go 2-0 for the day. This is not a spoiler. This is a fact. But Evan Nesterboy is pretty upset because he has some plans that he wants to do, spending time with his family. As apparently, it is family day at JMU. I did not know that. Yeah, 
Anywho, we started this tournament late, and we're still having a spirit of conversation. So, yeah. But, no, Andrew, I understand. Yeah, we, we thought we was going to have more teams, too. Kind of bummed out. I know. Penn State uh, is on spring break. Uh, yeah, Penn State's on spring break. And same thing with UVA. They're also on spring break, too. So, that's the reason why they're not here. We already know about the Towson situation. So, yeah. Anywho. They're going straight for my man. He got hit. Yep. He was probably better off just letting that play out. Unfortunately, make that four points for JMU. We're going to have time four to zero. <sighs> Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. We'll be back, guys. Yeah, no problem, Freddie. I'm glad you're enjoying the commentating. Steve, that was kind of messed up what Jamie you did to Bryce. Uh, <sighs> to a certain degree, you're probably right. Um, all to the same time. Um, when you're playing dodgeball, um, it is assumed that if you're on the court, equal rights also mean equal consequences. So everybody get treated equal. Uh, and nobody is exempt. But uh, she's not going to be playing for a while. And most likely, she's not going to be pinching for a while either. At least no time soon. And because JMU is up by four points, we're going to have a running clock through the derivation of the game. So let's get into it. We will only stop the clock with a timeout. Time will no longer be a factor for the derivation of this game. Evan Essenberg with the pump fake. Drew with the pump fake. Oh, good catch by number 25. Nick with the grown man catch. Not bad. Oh, God. It could have been disastrous. Daniel still safe. Getting a little chippy out here. All right, Evan. Let's see what Evan's going to do. Way by himself. Good catch. Actually, no catch. This is a kill for Evan. Let's see what Evan. Yeah, Evan's a little upset. Yeah. All right, let's see what Daniel's going to do. Not bad. Number 17, Tyler with the throw. Here come my man, number 24, Schaefer. They're kind of just chilling. Cool man just being silly, just dancing on the court. That's not a throw. That is a throw. Missed catch by Goodman. Schaefer with the kill. My man Turner over here with the fake mustache. They really did get the, the, the black shopper. Good reset throw by Daniel. Let's see what Evan's going to do. Oh, point blank. Missed catch by Daniel. And why do Goodman has his shirt? <laughs> Can't take this guy anywhere, I swear. <sighs> Jesus, man, this guy's. And, yeah, that's by the foot. Another kill by Evan. The more things change, the more they stay the same. You're in range. And Turner takes out Nathan Walls, number 11. Evan Esselberg was trying to go for number 98 with the headshot. Pretty sure he's going to be asking for that if he got it. Reset throw. Yeah, he really took his whole shirt off, man. I'm still kind of baffled about that. It makes no sense. By the foot? Is it a foot shot? All right, finally he took his shirt, put his shirt back on. Thank God. Thank you. God, Jesus! There's the headshot that we was looking for. Oh, God. Okay, they're kind of ramping things up a little bit. Yes, we did get that on camera. And one player left to be. This will be a running clock. Please, actually two players left. 
you, you should probably just step out for safety purposes. Not 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 because of anything else. Just just think about your personal well-being. Oh my God, Evan Estabrook goes out. Silliness from him. Dixon with the kill though. Good job on him. He's still competing. Oh, good catch though by Schaefer. One play left to be. Oh God. And by the foot. And James used now of five to zero. Like I said, we're gonna have a running clock throughout the derivation of this game. It's running clock. Running clock. Running clock. Running clock. Running clock, guys. Running clock. Like I said, when you're up by more than four within a point, it's running clock. Just keep it running. I got to go to cookout afterwards. I'm hungry. Actually, no. Actually, I'm good. No, I actually went to uh, Chick-fil-A. Uh, you know, got the four-piece meal with some hutch puppies. So you boys straight, you know. We're, we're straight. I don't – we're good. Anywho, 19 people watching on YouTube. I appreciate you. I want to check to see how many people is watching on uh, Twitch momentarily. Well, I appreciate you guys. Running clock. Seven so running clock. All right. I don't know how many people is on. Uh, holy crap. Yeah, Evan, Evan's trying to get a headshot of his own. Pretty sure that was, ooh, somebody, oh, good team catch. Good team catch, much needed. Oh, God, clap him. Yeah, number 25, Nick goes down out of chain. Good kill, but Drew Funk. And maybe, okay, yeah, now we'll count. Okay. We can zoom in a little bit. All right, somebody's going to have to throw, and they do. All right, let's see what's going to happen. All right, still safe. Pump fake. Another pump fake. Another kill. It was either Schaefer or Essenberg with the kill. Oh, that was close. Could have gone either way. Looked kind of close. He was thinking about it. He was thinking about it. All right, let's see what Drew's going to do. The throw. Oh, good, good pump. Good pump. Dial it back a little bit. Here comes the throw. All right, he's already out. Good reset throw by Daniel. Here it comes. Oh, all right, he's already ready. Good dive by Gross. All right, let's see. Throw. Oh. Let's zoom out a little bit. Oh, did he? Oh, man. Yeah, that's going to be a kill because he had the catch, but unfortunately, once it hit the ground, not really much you can do. Oh! Unsuccessful. Killed by Daniel. Oh, and he got hit. Well, actually, no, he didn't get hit. Unfortunately, he dropped his ball. Vincent goes down that exchange. Now 21. It's wearing it from Drew Funk. Drew on Drew cried once again, y'all. That Drew on Drew cried. Something else, man. Another kill for March. This time, number two, Chris, goes down this exchange. A lot of static. Hold on. Give me a minute. Hold up, Turner. 
See if I can fix the stat a little bit. Ah, Jesus. Come on. Hold up. Give me a minute. Actually, give me one minute, guys. Ugh. Jesus, be quiet. Pretty sure we missed that catch. But good catch, nevertheless, by Drew. Yo, why is it still staticky, though? Good team throw. Taking out another Maryland player. This time, number 24, Michael. And balls over. Will go against Maryland, and the clock would still be running. The clock would still be running. Lord Jesus, what is up with the static? No, be quiet. Ah, God, Jesus. Yeah, this is this is slightly annoying. I'll fix it later, but this is this is too much. All right, let's see what's going to happen here. All right, everybody's safe. Well, spoke too soon. God, three players go down that exchange, and that's pretty much all that you wrote. That's enough. And now it's six to zero in favor of JMU. Now, I think I kind of fixed the SATA issue. I think, my apologies for that. Oh God. Yeah. Yeah, okay, that fixed it. Sorry about that. Jesus, that was that was annoying. That that was slightly annoying. I'm not even gonna hold you. Actually, I probably didn't fix it. I thought I did. I thought I did. We got at least one player on Twitch, so that's cool. Much appreciated. Anywho. Anywho, let me go ahead and update the score. Let me update the score real quick. And now goes another player. Drew Fung with the kill. Reset throw. Fine. See what Colin's gonna do. Drew Fonz pretty much is chilling. Gross go down that exchange. Good kill by uh, Cohn. Dixon pushing up. Easy catch. And Turner gets the kill. Take it out, good man. Yeah. Okay, that's a little bit excessive. Oh God, yeah, I'm pretty sure I haven't heard something. The laziness of Evan Essenberg continues. <laughs> You're a silly guy, my guy. You're silly. You're a silly guy. Regardless of what the score is gonna be, each team will walk away with one win with the exception of Towson. They unfortunately go 0-3. One team will walk away with this tournament 2-1. and one. It's going to be against VCU and Maryland. Most likely, JMU will go 3-0. and 
So I'm pretty sure at this point they're just see what they can provide me for headshots. Well, that was a good kill. That was a good kill. Taking out number 24, Michael. And that's an easy catch. This time taking out Vincent. Good catch by Drew. She's still safe. Not bad. He just kind of misses. Misses from both Daniel and Evan Estabor, Marilyn and James U, respectfully. I think she's still safe. Marilyn has to throw. And that's not going to work. Good kill by Daniel. Taking out number eight. Man, clap him. 33 taking out, 33 Drew taking out number zero, Zach. Good reset throw by number two. Number two, Chris. Maryland has less than six plays left, so they will be on the 10 count. And that's a long throw, and that is a catch from a nameless JMU player with no jersey. Now make that four players left. Well, now make that one player left to be. This time it's going to be Daniel by himself. And uh, he's in a tough situation. And, well, that's all that she wrote. Easy money for Drew Funk. And Daniel's like, wait, what the heck just happened? Yes, it is a running clock, ladies and gentlemen. It is a running clock. It's a running clock. Literally means the clock would not stop running for the derivation of this game. The real question is, is how quickly JMU will get to 10 points. And the real question is, is when they're going to call this game? That's the real question. That's the real question. When are they going to call this game? I mean... I mean, don't get it twisted, man. Listen, I enjoy playing dodgeball well, more than the next person, man. Get your money's worth. But you got to be focusing for your next opponent that's going to be VCU. On a positive, though, at least the stream has been stable for the most part. So that's good. And all right, cool. Let's see what Evan Espo is going to do. All right, look like he's single out Daniel. Little captain on captain crime right there, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, he definitely want to go after Connor. And he got another kill against Connor, number 33. Let's see what Drew's going to do. It's going to relax. Good kill by number 17, taking out number 21 of Maryland, which is Drew. Oh, good catch by Daniel. <laughs> Schaefer with the, unfortunately, Schaefer threw Daniel that catch. And Gross goes out by number 17, Tally. Drew on the ground. Oh, he got him on the ground. Down goes number 11, Nathan Walls. Oh, and just Evan Essenberg. Just out here just touring with Maryland. Woo! Just touring with them. With the cross, taking out Goodman. He's just, just touring with them at this point. Oh, my God. Man, they're making number three, Vincent, work. He got somebody. And Evan Estabrook taking out number zero, Zach of Maryland. Somebody made a catch. Well, actually, I'm pretty sure that catch got Connor back in. That was uh, Daniel got the catch that brought up Connor back in the game. Uh, but Maryland's back on the 10 count. Cross. All right, number 17, uh, Tally will get his ball back. Let's see if Evan looking for the cross. Uh... Yeah, that's a catch. And down goes Connor. 
Man. Just having a rough time. But hey, listen, it, it happened to a lot of people playing against JMU, at least when I was playing him. God, Jesus. Really sure we got that on camera. All right, three plays left to be. Oh, drop catch. Dixon taking out number one, Dancy. Oh, man. Uh, easy catch. Down goes number 25, Nick. All right, so now it's just Dixon and Daniel. Dixon number one, Daniel number 33. One is on the left, 33 is on the right. All right, so Dixon's way up. JMU only got one ball, so this is very important. So let's see if we can zoom in a little bit. This is kind of important. All right, now JMU got two balls. Now here's a kicker. Because JMU have less than three balls, they do not have to throw. This is very important. All right, now JMU got three balls. Now they have to throw. So let's go ahead and zoom out just a little bit. Maryland, unfortunately, have less than six players on the court, and they are still on a 10 count. JMU, on the other hand, whoo, made that one play left to be. Now go Dixon. Uh, JMU's at a full 15. And Maryland, unfortunately, is on 10. Uh, so Daniel, at some point, got to do something. Yeah. yeah that's not going to work. Made that 8-0 to zero in favor of the Dukes. You know, at some point, we need to find a chill. I don't think that's going to happen. At some point, you got to find a chill. Hey, my man, Eric Fisher from Dinosaur Ice Machine. Much appreciated to you, sir, BCU alum. Thank you for the support. Try to make it entertaining for you. Try to be respectful of everybody's time. We got 19 people watching the stream right now. Just want to say thank you for tuning in. My name is Shadi Drake for uh, di Director of Eternal Affairs for the NCDA, also known as Ready to Stream for my small business. Uh, uh, it's getting a little loud now, okay. Um, we'll get a little loud now. But, uh, but yeah, I run a business called Ready to Stream LOC. We're helping out the folks in the DMV region. D.C., Maryland, and Virginia. I'm a V.C. alumni, so my team will be playing later on today. Well, actually, they'll be playing against next against JMU. As this game has been essentially been over. <laughs> Jesus. And down go Dixon. Good kill by Drew Funk, number 33, head captain of JMU. Evan Essenberg put a little extra sauce into the mix. Soft changeup, unfortunately, 21. Drew, another Drew on Drew crime, another Drew on Drew crime. Let's see what Shafe is going to do. Not bad from number 99. Yeah, three and a half. I don't think Jamie is going to get to 10 points, but that's kind of irrelevant at this point. Here comes Schaefer. Oh, no! A missed catch by Daniel. Oh, you hate to see it. Another missed catch by Daniel. It's kind of weird seeing Daniel missing some of these catches. This is very unorthodox of him. Very unorthodox. This is, this is unusual for me. Oh, yeah. Good kill by Evan Essenberg taking out number zero, Zach of Maryland. We are now in the three minutes, like I said, running clock, so it doesn't really matter what the time is. It's going to be zero soon enough. And, yeah, yeah, 24 goes down. That change. 24, Michael of Maryland goes down. Good kill by number 17, Tally of JMU. And don't look now, but, Jam but uh, Maryland is back on the 10 count once again. Wow. Jesus. 
Oh my God. The clock is still running, so it doesn't really matter at this point. Yo, okay, now we gotta, now. What? Wow, we, jeez. We really got, now, now we really have to stop the clock because of a timeout call. We could have just kept this game going. Jesus. Ignore the timer, guys. Man, y'all making me work, man. This game should have been over. You're making me work on a Saturday, man. I already put in my 40 hours a week. Anywho, irrelevant at this point. All right, cool. All right, let's see what Drew's going to do. He wants to put somebody to, woo! Yeah, that's going to count as a headshot. And he put the two, the, two, the two fingers up. No cursing, though. No flicking off, which is good. Just a little bang, bang action. Speaking of which, let's see what Evan Essenberger. Oh, man. He almost had it. Oh, he dropped the catch. Oh, my God. Evan, you dropped it. What are you doing? March with the kill. God, Jesus. Please end the game. End it, please. Please end this game. Please. Please end this game. Please. Please end this game. End it now, please. I've seen enough, man. 9-0. Somebody's going to be saying, Roll Duke. God, Jesus. Can we just end this? Just, just end it. Please end this game. We don't need to do this no more. Please end this game right now. I've seen enough. God, Jesus, man. Final score, 9-0 in favor of... The Dukes. JMU versus VCU coming up next.